Thank you, Mr. Chairman. You know, I'm, as I've listened uh, to uh, your testimony and uh, going through this process, I, you know, and, and I guess your commission work uh, was what, about a two year? Uh, two years. Two years? And aren't you glad it's over? <laughs> uh, <so>. Yes. <laughs> well, well, we. We certainly thank you for uh, investing that amount of time in, in what is a very uh, uh, emotional uh, subject. Uh, of course, I, I have to say that uh, the idea of forming anything new up here is less than uh, inspiring. And so to think about forming some type of new agency or organization, uh, I, I'm not sure that we, uh, we can endure a, perhaps another dysfunctional uh, uh, group, but uh, but perhaps uh, this is uh, uh, this is where you've landed. Uh, I, I'd like to just read to you uh, something that was put out by that that was said by the Nuclear Energy Institute, uh, Edison Electric Institute, uh, American Public Power Association, National Rural Electric Cooperative Association, the National Association of Regulatory Utility Commissioners, and the Nuclear Waste Strategy Coalition. What they said last week about Yucca Mountain. We continue to believe that the Nuclear Regulatory Commission's review of the DOE's license application for the proposed Yucca Mountain in Nevada repository should be completed to determine whether it is a suitable site. Uh, you know, your report says that, that we need a geologic repository. Uh, do you agree or disagree with those groups that we ought to take advantage of these billions of dollars that have been spent so far on Yucca Mountain? and find out if it is indeed a suitable or unsuitable repository. Uh, <laughs> we, uh, you want me to just move to the next question? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> no. Well, look, a commission was formed. And a com we, we operated under a mandate and under rules. We followed those rules, and the rules were we were not going to get into Yucca. Okay, and, and certainly, but your duties are over, so I'm, I'm asking the, the, the question. The, we have, uh, we have the, the beautiful report right here. So the question is, should we, with all the money, the billions of dollars have been spent, should we not at least, that, does it not make sense to find out if it is indeed suitable or not? Well, well let, let, let me respond this way, and uh, this is not a, really a direct answer to your question, but I, I think it's a fair response. I, uh, there has been a feeling here for 30 years or more that once the next election comes, the results of that election will be so decisive that Yucca Mountain will be resolved one way or the other. It hadn't happened. It has not happened. Now, it may happen the next election. I don't think it's likely, but it could happen. And that's a possibility. Our view, however, is that we've now had 30, 40 years experience. And as a country, we've not been able to reach a solution to the problem. You can blame whomever you want to. I suspect there's plenty of blame to go along. And we've heard some specific names just today. But the fact is that the process we are now following has not worked for whatever reason. And it continues to roll up huge costs of the American tax <laughs> for the American taxpayer. The liabilities explode into the future. And there are all kinds of damages to the American uh, national interest. OK. We have to find a way forward. We've got to find a way forward to solve this problem. It could be the next election will solve it. I don't think it will, but it could be. Uh, it hasn't in the past. So we're operating on the assumption in the commission that we had to try to find a new way forward, and that's what we did. You, know, it, you put a lot of emphasis on the consent-based uh, process yes. on how to do, uh, uh, how someone should move forward on this. But it appears, certainly looking at the map that the chairman pulled up, of uh, local consent that's there, uh, it, it, it met what appears to be that criteria, but yet someone else was able to intervene, whether that's the Senate Majority Leader or someone else. How do we get to the point of where we can actually make a decision on this? And I, and I have to say, Yucca Mountain has met that criteria, yet it's been rejected. So my, my confidence level 
is not real strong and my time is up but it yeah. appears to me that we should complete this licensing process get back on track and let's find out if indeed it's a suitable mm -hmm. process i mm -hmm. thank you both for your time yeah uh, yield yeah. back Mr. Chair.